gotta stop, gotta gotta stop, gotta gotta stop, gotta gotta stop playing this, gotta stop, gotta gotta stop, gotta stop, gotta playing this. What's up, gamers? I'm John, and welcome back to my Level Up News, where I bring you the latest and greatest in gaming news every day. Today's November 18th, 2024, and we've got an epic lineup of stories. From Helldivers 2, Chaotic New, Democracy Space Station, and Altier Yumiya's Mechanics 2, Destiny 1 Remastered, and leaks about Zenless Zone Zero. We're also diving into Dragon Quest 3's remake, World of Warcraft's loot controversy, and GOG's preservation efforts, and the return of a fan favorite event in Genshin Impact. Let's get you leveled up with today's news, and don't forget to join our Discord to share your thoughts. Games Radar reports that Helldivers 2 Democracy Space Station has divided the community. Introduced as a community voted feature, the station delivers devastating explosive attacks, but its collateral damage is often just as deadly to the players using it. Friendly fire incidents have become a meme among players with countless matches derailed by its chaotic blast radius. While some see the unpredictability as part of the game's charm, others argue it undermines the tactical nature that Helldivers 2 is known for. Developers have acknowledged the mixed feedback, hinting at possible tweaks to balance the feature. However, some players believe that embracing the chaos is what makes the game unique. Will the Democracy Space Station become a refined tool of destruction or remain a symbol of hilarious mayhem? Only time and player feedback will tell. WCCF Tech reveals that Altia Yumiya, the Alchemist of Memories, is making bold strides to evolve the beloved Altia series. The combat system introduces dynamic and elemental combos, encouraging players to strategize and adapt their approaches during battles. Meanwhile, the revamped synthesis system ties directly into exploration with crafted tools unlocking hidden paths and solving elemental puzzles. The developers have emphasized that these changes aim to create a seamless connection between combat, alchemy, and adventure. Fans are also excited about the richly detailed world, which features vibrant characters and a compelling story. Critics are already speculating that these innovations could redefine the series' identity while maintaining its heart. With so much writing on these updates, will Altia Yumiya exceed expectations? Players won't have to wait long to find out as its release date approaches soon. According to Forbes, Bungie is considering a remaster of Destiny 1, sparking excitement and worries in the gaming community. On one hand, fans of the original are eager to relive iconic moments like the Vault of Glass and Crota's End with updated visuals and mechanics. On the other hand, some players question whether Bungie's resources should be spent on reviving an older game when Destiny 2 still has room for growth. A remaster could also attract new players, introducing them to the roots of the franchise in a published package. However, Bungie's current workload, including its upcoming marathon project, raises concerns about its ability to manage multiple major endeavors. The question remains whether nostalgia is enough to warrant the investment. If Destiny 1 returns, will it be the celebration fans hope for or a distraction from future innovations? Let me know your comments down below. GameRat reports that leaks for Zelda Zone Zero reveal a new expansive cyberpunk overworld filled with interactive hubs and vibrant locations. Players can expect to engage in quests, mini games, and dynamic exploration, creating a lively urban fantasy experience. The new League characters showcase a diverse lineup, each with unique abilities that will shape combat and exploration in significant ways. Hoyo vs. clearly aiming to replicate its success with Genshin Impact while carving out a unique identity for this new title. Fans are particularly intrigued by the game's mix of futuristic aesthetics and engaging storytelling. These leaks have sparked discussions about how Zelda Zone Zero will balance action and narrative. With the hype building steadily, players are eager for official details. Can this game live up to the expectations set by its predecessor, or will it break new ground on its own right? GameRat explains how Metaphor ReFantasio takes cues from the Persona series while introducing a politically charged fantasy setting. This shift away from familiar high school backdrop allows for deeper world building and more mature themes. Players will navigate a spiraling story filled with intrigue, magic, and complex relationships, all while engaging in strategic combat that Atlas is known for. The game's stunning art direction and music have drawn comparisons to Persona, yet it's clear Metaphor is carving its own path. Fans are already debating whether the absence of high school elements will elevate or diminish the experience. Will Metaphor ReFantasio redefine Atlas's RPG legacy, or will it remain in the shadow of its predecessors? 
The Verge calls Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake a love letter to fans. The game's retro-inspired visuals blend classic pixel art with modern lighting, creating a visually stunning experience. Enhanced mechanics including updated combat and streamlined progression ensure that the game feels fresh while honoring its roots. The remastered soundtrack breathes new life into iconic tracks immersing players in its nostalgic charm. Critics and fans alike are praising the remake for capturing the essence of the original while adding modern polish. It's being hailed as one of the best RPG remakes in recent memories. Will this set a new standard for future remakes or is it a one-time masterpiece? Let me know your thoughts down below. GameVidon reports that World of Warcraft players are growing increasingly frustrated with the game's recent events, citing underwhelming loot rewards as a recurring issue. This marks the fourth event in 2024 alone where players felt the grind wasn't worth the effort, leading to heated discussions in the community. Blizzard acknowledged the criticism, stating that repeated missteps can erode trust, but that they have yet to announce concrete solutions. At the same time, discussions about whether WoW might benefit from a clean state have gained traction among fans and developers alike. With 20 years of history behind it, the idea of a reset is controversial but intriguing. Is Blizzard's iconic MMO at a crossroads, or is it still delivering meaningful updates to keep players engaged? Let me know your comments down below. Kotaku highlights GOG's latest push to ensure the gaming's past remains accessible in the future. By focusing on DRM-free versions of classic titles and modern capability, GOG is preserving the legacy of beloved games for today's players. This initiative is especially important as digital storefronts increasingly shift their focus to newer releases, leaving many classics in danger of being forgotten. Gamers have praised GOG for keeping these gems alive, emphasizing the importance of preservation in an ever-changing industry. With its robust library of retro games, GOG has become a haven for fans of gaming history. Will other platforms follow suit or will GOG remain the torchbearer of the gaming's past? Let me know your comments down below. GameRant reveals that leaks suggest the return of Arataki Ito Beetle Brawl event in Genshin Impact. This quirky minigame allows players to battle beetles in fun and competitive format, offering unique rewards and a break from the game's usual grind. Fans are particularly excited about rumors of new challenges and expanded features which can make the event even more engaging than before. Ito's charisma and humor are expected to bring levity to the experience, drawing both veterans and newcomers into the event. Hoyoverse's attention to fan favorite content is being praised as a smart move to maintain player engagement. Are you ready to roll your beetle into battle or are you holding out for bigger updates? Let me know your thoughts down below. And that's a wrap for today's gaming news. From Helldivers 2's chaotic democracy space station to Genshin Impact's quirky beetle battles, we covered it all. Don't forget to join our community on Discord to share your thoughts, connect with other gamers, and get exclusive updates. The invite link is down in the description. Drop a comment below, hit the like, subscribe, and tap that bell so you never miss out on level up news. See you next time, gamers. Gotta stop, gotta, gotta stop. Gotta, gotta stop, gotta, gotta stop playing this. Gotta stop, gotta, gotta stop. Gotta stop, gotta play this game.